Hey, what's going on YouTube? Jonathan from VFX Shorts here. I'm going to be showing you a really cool thing you can do with your MacBook Pro. Or any computer, uh, for that matter. So here we got a MacBook Pro. And, um, don't worry about the iMac in the background. It's just there. And, um, I have hooked up right here to my uh, Sony Bravia TV. And as you can see, it looks pretty nice. It's a, a through HDMI, so... As you can see back here, I got this uh, triple HDMI converter because I only have one HDMI port back here. So, and I got this HDMI cable running all the way here to this. Uh, well, that's out of focus. Uh, let's see. Uh, it's really okay. Whatever. Um, here to this, uh, the Apple HDMI converter to Mini Display Port. They also have it for Thunderbolt, so I'm gonna have to get that to use it for my Mac. But I really don't need it for that. But this is really cool. So, and I'm probably gonna use this one for what I'm for my needs because this uh, cable right here, it is 12 feet, so I can sit back on my couch over there. And um, sorry, I have a bit of a mess. So what I have here set up is uh, my screen, t my TV set up here. And um, so whatever I do here, there's no mouse going on here. It's all movement, as you can see the mouse on the TV. So in order, what I have here, I have if once you plug it into a second monitor, you uh, you'll have this arrangement tab pop up. So this one on the left is the MacBook Pro, and this one on the right is the uh, my Sony Bravia TV. And how you know which one is the um, uh, like the the what's the, the primary display is that you'll have this b white bar here. And that represents like the bar on the top. So if I move that over to here, this becomes red. And then I'll drag it over. And now I have full control here. Actually, no, I didn't drag it over properly. Let me drag it over. I do have, huh. Strange. I should be having full control on this one. Actually, I do. There we go. I just drag it all over the way. So here now I have the control, I have the bar here. And then here I can bring this over. As you can see. Sorry for my lack of concentration. So here uh, we have here and I can just drag this tab over. Wah. And now it's over here on my MacBook Pro. So now let's change it back to this because I really like this display. What I'm going to end up doing, I do have a magic mouse for my iMac, so that's going to save it. I did purchase a Magic Mouse before, but I had my iMac for my computer, so I'm going to use that, but I'll probably buy uh, a keyboard, an external keyboard like this, so I might just switch from this and uh, and then uh, put it like on a little, like one of those little, like a wooden board or something so I can sit on the couch and edit my videos, do some uh, photo editing on here. So I'm going to switch this back to this one. And now, here in the Sony TV once again. And then I can also click on mirror displays. Oh, and as you can see, the display is different. Uh, on uh, Before I go to the mirror displays, the display is different. So here, it's 1080, excuse me, 1080i because of the HDMI. And if so, when, it, when I first plugged it in, it was more like that. So you didn't see the bar, but then you can just change it so you can have, fits your screen as perfect as possible. And uh, you can change the rotation and all that. But I'm going to see. We're going to go here. We're going to mirror displays. So whatever I'm doing on here on my MacBook Pro, um, as you can see, I'm doing everything here. It will show up on here. But I don't. that's not what I'm going to. I'm going to set it up with the dual monitor. So that's pretty cool. And then if I wanted to, I could switch this so as I said this one represents my MacBook Pro and that one is, represents my TV so I can drag this over and it'll be on the right side now but since my TV my so let's say if I drag here if I go to the right it'll come off the right side of the screen here but that's not my rotation so it's gonna be pretty awkward so I'm gonna have to go back and I'm gonna have to switch that here so I'm gonna set up like that Okay, yeah, that's all for this one, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll probably do some more quick tutorials like this. I think these are fun. You know, maybe someone's got a MacBook Pro and a TV, and they, they didn't know they could go spend 30 bucks on the adapter and 
have a nice editing setup for them. So that's all for this one, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Peace.